Russian authorities said Sunday they had opened a murder investigation after the daughter of influential, ultranationalist philosopher Alexander Dijin was killed by a car bomb on the outskirts of Moscow. At least 15 people killed in Gaziantep province and 20 others killed in Mardin province in separate incidents. MMA fighting reacts to Leon Edwards' incredible title-winning KO in the main event of UFC 278, Luke Rockhold's retirement after a war with Paulo Costa, and more. An emotional Anthony Joshua fought back tears as he reflected on his second straight loss to Alexander Yusik in Jeddah on Saturday, saying he was deeply upset with his performance against the Ukrainian heavyweight champion. At least 12 people were killed after Al-Shabaab militants took hostages in the popular Mogadishu Hotel. Destiny 2 looks like it's getting Fortnite skins soon. Leakers have revealed Fortnite-like skins that are supposedly part of a crossover between Bungie and Epic Games.